Fire Emblem. Engage. What's up, gamers? It's Arkin here, and welcome back to Fire Emblem Engage. Let's go ahead and see what is up after the end of that harrowing battle. Oh, cutscene. Nice. That's so pretty. <gasps> Uh, another wife. Uh, Love it. Uh, mm, maybe not. <laughs> That's a small person. There's no need to be afraid. It's gone. Girl, you just might have made it into the thumbnail of this video. I'm not even gonna lie. You saved my life. Thank you. It was nothing, really. I only did what anyone else would do. Are you here by yourself? I am. I saw the fighting and thought I could help. You're braver than I am. I can't stand the corrupted. I was so startled, I couldn't think. You really did save my life. I see. Oh, I haven't introduced myself yet. I'm the Divine Dragon. What a lovely name. I'm Vale. Vale. Hmm. Might I interrupt? What is it? Even with the Corrupted gone, it may not be safe for her out here. Perhaps we should escort her home, or to an inn. That's a good idea. Hey, Vale, do you live around here? Huh? Guess not. She's gone. Hey. Divine One! Saline, did you see a girl pass this way? Small, with long hair? Barefoot? No, I'm afraid I didn't see anyone matching that description. <sighs> okay, thanks. Did you need something? I wanted to thank you. Alfred told me that you accepted Firinay's request for aid. Absolutely. We're here to help. And your help in the battle was the difference between victory and defeat. Thank you. Truly. You using that emblem was the difference between victory and defeat. Don't mention it. Alfred and I are friends. I was happy to help. Friends? He said that? Imagine speaking so casually with the Divine Dragon. Please, allow me to apologize on his behalf. There's no need to put me on a pedestal. I just woke up, and the world is new to me. I make mistakes like anyone. Is that so? I thought surely the Divine Dragon would be an all-seeing, all-powerful being. Mm, no. But here I find that you are rather more... human than I expected. Perhaps... Then what do you say, Saline? Friends? I would be honored. All right, the battle is over and let's go ahead and do a little bit of dialogue. If there's anything that's interesting that pops up, you'll see it, but if not, we'll just go ahead and keep it moving. Now, this is a very nice touch. I do love that I can find these animals and adopt them. That makes me happy. We're absolutely taking this dog back to the Somnio. Oh, oh. All right, every animal. You can't. Oh no. Okay, bad. Saw that there is a sheep here. Can we adopt the sheep? Yes. Yes. More of this. This is true gameplay. So we've done some walking around, adopted some animals, talked to. The groups here. Let's go ahead and move on. Hey, folks. Mind if we bend your ear a minute? Go ahead. Hmm? 
Name's Durton. I'm an armor. And this here's Anis, purveyor of goods. Please join we us. saw you trading thumps with those things. Figured you might be in the market for supplies. Yes. If you need, we'd be happy to provide you with quality weapons and items. Anything to defeat those creatures. They pose a terrible threat to traveling merchants like us. How would you feel about moving to our base? You can sell your wares from there. <clears throat> Divine One. What? We don't have any facilities. These two could be a good addition. You're gonna let us open shops at your base? If you'd like to. We'll need plenty of weapons and items from here on out. It's a haven. You won't find any creatures there. You got yourself a bargain. Can't wait to do business together. Thank you for this. I will do my utmost to ensure you receive the finest items. Yes. Whoa! This is where the game starts. Yo. Dude. This is cool. Oh, man. All right, so I was just messing around with the marketplace and inventory and stuff. It didn't really change much, but I was just engrossing myself in this game. This is this is dangerous. I'm going to spend a lot of time playing this. All right, let's go ahead and begin the next chapter. Chapter five, retaking the castle. Let's get it. There's the castle. It's so quiet. Where are our knights? Or the Illusion soldiers, for that matter? You said they were marching toward the castle when you left. They've probably made their way inside. But then, what of the townsfolk? What of Mother? Let's hurry. Let's go. Ooh. Hate to break it to you, Queenie. But our forces have taken the castle. This is the part where you tell me where you've got the ring stashed in here. Who's to say? Is it inside the castle? Out on the grounds? I'm asking all polite like. Come on! <laughs> I'm not in the habit of speaking to lowly vermin. That's all that you are, the lot of you. The mouth on this one. You think I won't cut you where you stand? <sighs> I'd recommend against it, darling. Lady Zephyr! After all, Her Majesty can't tell us much of value if she's dead. Now, I come bearing news. One of our soldiers said he spotted the princess fleeing before we arrived. How curious. Did you perhaps give that daughter of yours the ring for safekeeping? Well, isn't this tragic? We'd simply hate to resort to violence. You leave us no choice. By virtue of your silence, we will now kill every living soul in this castle one by one. <sighs> Please, no! Okay, things are ripping up. This is getting crazy. I'm so excited. Mother! Mother! We're here! Alfred, Saline. Oh, look, the kids are home. You illusion scum! Get away from her! <laughs> Who's going to make us? I'm glad you've come. Now we can see for ourselves if the princess has the ring. No, please, leave my children alone. Of course, as long as you tell me where the ring is. I... Ah, young Saline does have it, doesn't she? We'll have to kill her then. The prince too, for good measure. Take her majesty away. We'll continue our conversation later if need be. Unhand me! It's on her in the hands. Mother! Let her go! All right, enough with the dramatics. Huh? You... You look familiar. <sighs> no, it couldn't be. Who are you? I am the Divine Dragon. Such lies. Lumera is the last of her kind. 
shows what you know. The Divine One was asleep for a thousand years. Really? When did that beastly woman have a child? Hey, yo, calm down. Very well. Perhaps you can tell me what happened to dear Lumera then. I've been so worried about her since that awful battle at Letho's castle. How do you know about that? How indeed. You stole the rings? You killed my mother? She died? Oh, that poor dear. <laughs> Murderer. I will avenge her. Why, I didn't kill her. I will say your coming here was quite helpful. Assuming you are the beast's offspring. Because that means you have them, don't you? The rings of the Hero King and the Holy Knight. You'll never take them. Never. You were after a ring. I won't waste my breath on explanations, but I will tell you this. The Kingdom of Illusia has freed Lord Zombron from his imprisonment. The oh. Fell Dragon has returned? No. Of course, even we couldn't have accounted for... you. His return must have awoken you. Show a little gratitude. You're wrong. I awoke because of my mother. Because she waited for me. All these years. A touching tale, I'm sure. Now, if you'll excuse me. Wait. Well, no, come back. What can we do? To start, we defeat these soldiers and take back the castle. I'm not going to let them hurt Queen Ev or anyone else. Get the rings. No prisoners. I was hoping you'd say that. I hate you and your voice. Oh, you already know. The door's locked. What should we do? There's no time to find the key. Let's use brute force to knock it down. Before I gamble, we're going to knock him down just a little bit. Stay there. Back here. Oh no. This is so not 21 damage. Okay. All right. So you should be able to finish it. Thank goodness you dodged. Oh man, this would have been so much easier still it didn't go down. All right, it took forever, but we got there. Wow. Okay. All right. That is where the story will end for now. All right, gamers, if you enjoyed the video, like, comment, and subscribe. It would mean the world to me, and I'll catch you in the next one. Till then.